I have here. switch so I'm gonna go get a coupling I'll show you why so I put a coupling on here because that doesn't go there like that I get a coupling you know make it right up Let me, let me go get a coupling. All right, it's the only coupling I hit on the truck. I'll give it a flush. not hindering it at all. Hmm. Damn Climate Masters radiator coil. Let me flush it out. Okay. 
And again, everything's zip tied. back. Hmm. Got that sensor too. Hmm. Let's see if it cleared the code. Alright, I'm back up and running. I'm gonna get the door on here. This is in a residential neighborhood, it's really strange. Alright, we got it up and running, pain cleared out, we're good to go. Yeah, that, that one was, that was simple, but you know, you look at what was done on the, just last year, they replaced that sensor. Those sensors don't go bad. All it is is you could stick a wire on the thing and it's just continuity to the ground. That's all it is. I don't know why they replaced the sensor. That's downright stupid. So I think they had a slow drain. Guy's like, oh, the sensor's bad because it's still fault now and he didn't reset it. <clears throat> he replaced the sensor and then by that time the drain was down. And then it probably consistently probably kept on happening um kind of strange why they would replace that sensor the, the sensors all it is is a it's not even uh it's nothing it's a piece of metal and a piece of plastic all it is is continuity to the ground and that that's what says hey i'm full shut me off so apparently i don't think they clean the drain line out that's what it was so simple easy fix um you know that's typical geo stuff you know see a lot of block drains on the geos okay guys like and subscribe and i'll see you on the next one